When you, all the surgeries you've done, have you seen consciousness in there ever? Was there like a glowing light? You know, I have this sense that uh, I never found it. Okay. Never removed it, you know, oh. like like a Dementor in Harry Potter. Um, I have this sense that consciousness is a lot less magical than our instincts want to claim it is. Um, it, it seems to me like a useful analog for thinking about what consciousness is in the brain, um, you know, is that we, we have a really good intuitive understanding of what it means to say, touch your skin and know what's being touched. Um, I think consciousness is just that level of sensory mapping applied to the, the thought processes in the brain itself. So what I'm saying is consciousness is the sensation of some part of your brain being active. So you you feel it working. You feel the part of your brain that thinks of red things or winged creatures or the taste of coffee. You feel those parts of your brain being active the way that I'm feeling my palm being touched, mm -hmm. right? And that sensory system that feels the brain working is consciousness. That is so brilliant. It's the same way, it's the sensation of touch when you're touching a thing. Consciousness is the sensation of you feeling your brain working, your brain thinking, your brain perceiving. Which isn't, <laughs> which isn't like a warping oh. of space time or, or some quantum yeah. field effect, right? It's nothing magical. People always want to ascribe to consciousness something truly different. Uh, and, and there's this awesome long history of people looking at whatever the latest discovery in physics is to explain consciousness um, because it's the most magical, the most out there thing that you can think of. And, and people always you know, want to do that with consciousness. I don't think that's necessary. It's just a, you know, a very useful and gratifying way of feeling your brain work. And as we said, it's one heck of a brain. Yeah. Everything we see around us, everything we love, everything that's beautiful is, came from brains like these. It's all electrical activity happening inside your skull. <laughs> and uh, I, for one, am uh, grateful that there's people like you that are uh, exploring all the ways that it works and all the ways it can be made better. Uh, Thanks, Matthew, Thank you so much for talking today. Uh, it's been a joy.